Welcome to Informatica support videos. My name is Vishal and I will be taking through this video. In this video I will demonstrate on how to configure AS2 inbound. Before we start AS2 inbound we will have a little overview of AS2. What is AS2? AS2 is a secure protocol for exchanging files over HTTP or HTTPS. It uses certificate for transmitting files and it is capable of sending or acknowledging the MDN received. With AS2 we can send or receive files. We have separate video in support channel for configuring AS2 outbound that is configuration for sending the files using Informatica MFT. With AS2 inbound we mean trading partners will upload the files to the Informatica servers. Trading partners act as a client to the Informatica MFT and upload the files. In Informatica MFT, there will be a listener service which will accept the files and acknowledge the MDN receipt. So there are prerequisite to configure AS2 inbound. Both the partner and Informatica MFT should have AS2 ID. AS2 ID is unique and helps to identify the partners. Certificates, public and private key cert certificate. We need to create certificate and share only the public certificate between the partners and Informatica MFT. Create web user in Informatica MFT. So here we can see that the Informatica between two organizations we should have a public and private key and the public key is the one which is shared between two organizations. So between Informatica and a partner there will be the keys will be which, which will be shared. Configuring inbound AS2 has two parts to set up AS2 service and creating trading partners. So first we will see how to configure AS2 service. So for creating AS2 service we need AS2 ID, decryption private certificate in Informatica MFT. We create a, the certificate in Informatica MFT and provide an, a directory path where we the users when the users uploads the files it lands into a particular directory. Whether we have to send or acknowledge the MDN received or not, and configure policies like authentication, signature. So, we have to set up all this in Informatica AS2 service while creating the AS2 service. Then, we have to create next step will be to create trading partner. For creating trading partner, we need to have a AS2 ID for the partner, the certificate for validating the signature. So we should get a public set public key from the partner and import into the uh, Informatica MFT. Whether we wanted to have a uh, automatic or manual up MDN approval, we need to have a setting. Uh, if we need to override anything specifically, the like the directory or the signature or authentication, which is part of services, we can override for that partner specifically. In while configuring the trading partner. Now we will proceed towards the demo. So we have a MF MFT console available. We will log into MFT console. We will go to the service, service manager, edit HTTPS AS2, go to AS2 click on enabled and provide the AS2 ID decryption private key this is a private key of Informatica MFT where MFT server is running and the default upload directory for the partner when they upload the file it will create a folder and upload with this name and the files are uploaded there we have to configure the MF MDN received if you want to keep the receipt click click on this and then give the private key again for the signature uh, certificate save the configuration and start the service so the next step would be to configure the trading partner we have to go to users web users and create a web user provide the web user name or details go 
go to AS2 tab important to give the AS2 um, ID and get the public key of that partner so this is the public key of for that AS2 user for that partner and save it so once this configuration is done allow the the partner of the users to send the file and once they send a file we can see that say I have a user partner new with, with who is uploading a file we can see a, the activity been logged here and he has sent a file which is read 35 we can see we can verify that we have received as2 message re received successful okay. we can verify that there is a mft as2 host that's an basically the as2 id and then external as2 id is the as2 id of this machine we can go to the logs and see here and we can ver also verify the MDN received so this concludes the video the for the AS2 inbound thanks for watching this video we would like to hear from you please do write to us on support videos at informatica.com or follow us in the twitter thank you